Dear colleagues, this is, is another soft uh, cataract done in subcranial anesthesia. Uh, injecting uh, some um, adrenaline to try to have a better pupil, but that's not happening so much. The pupil is still um, on a smaller side, probably. 5.5 millimeters or so, but that's not a big deal. We fashion up the capsular axis with a grease our forceps 25 gauge. This is a very easy task to do, aiming to make the capsular axis as large as the pupil at least. And um, Using that uh, pupil margin as a reference, uh, it's very easy to fashion this uh, capsular axis and um, enlarging the, one of the incisions, making the main incision, injecting the vasculastic, and then using the FACO needle to hold the nucleus and um, chopper, we do the horizontal chop. This is a um, FACO needle, FACO probe from um, Centurion. It's a very easy way to do the FACO massification with this machine. A lateral chop and then um, taking out the, um, the quadrants that are uh, divided, using the chopper to bring the piece centrally and uh, pretty much aspirating it uh, is very easy with the FAC machine since it's a very soft nucleus, it's not a hard cataract. Keeping in place the half of the nucleus and the, the quadrant, it's moved around uh, using the, the chopper, placing it in front of the FACO needle and then uh, easily getting aspirated inside the bag using the bevel down position on the FACO probe. It's, um, the FACO massification is very controlled by the foot pedal and one of the hemineucleus is it's, um, emulsified already and then the other half is bring it uh, in the middle and with the chopper it's easy to crack and have um, a horizontal chop down and then using the, the chopper we, we do some more um, chopping, keeping up the, um, keeping down inside the bag the, the nucleus to not fly around the AC and in the same time protecting the, the posterior capsule to not come forward. This um, long chopper is very useful in doing all these uh, maneuvers. The last part of the nucleus is um, aspirated and emulsified and um, then I'm going to use um, the um, AC maintainer and uh, the needle to aspiration, pour, uh, aspiration cannula to finish up the cortical removal. It's uh, another case of multifocal IOL from um, CIFI. This is um, an Adolf platform, and um, the patient have um, early stages of uh, closed angle glaucoma. So I will take care of the anterior synechia at the end of the case also, and pressing down the. Um, Iris root will um, will do that job.
for me and on this way the IOP post op it's kept at uh, minimum and um, finishing the cortical removal injecting the IOL inside the bag the last uh, haptic is getting uh, left behind a little bit but uh, it's not getting broken or anything and um, uh, I well it's well placed inside the the bag and rotating into the position cleaning up the anterior chamber from the viscoelastic and uh, injecting the myocal to constrict the pupil and the air bubble at the end and the subconj anti-inflammatory and uh, antibiotic agent. Thank you for your attention. Hope this will help you in your practice also.